The Tanjavur Palace, also known as the Maratha Palace, is a historically significant site in the city of Tanjavur. One of the most captivating aspects of the palace is its Darbar Hall, a magnificent venue where the Maratha kings of Tanjavur held court and conducted administrative affairs. The Darbar Hall of the Tanjavur Palace, also known as the Raja Sarfoji Memorial Hall, is a marvel of Maratha architecture and artistry. Its story is deeply intertwined with the history of the Maratha dynasty that ruled Tanjavur from the late 17th century until the British annexation in the mid 19th century. The Darbar Hall is renowned for its stunning architecture which reflects a blend of Maratha and Dravidian styles. It features an intricately decorated ceiling adorned with vibrant frescoes and intricate stucco work. The walls are lined with statues of Maratha rulers and deities creating an ambience of regal grandeur. The hall's design was intended to impress and awe visitors showcasing the wealth and power of the Maratha kings. The hall was a venue for important state of functions, royal ceremonies and public audiences. It was here that the Maratha rulers would meet with their courtiers, military commanders and subjects. One of the most notable rulers associated with the Darbar Hall is Sir Foji II from 1777 to 1832, a scholar and patron of arts and culture. Under his reign, Tanjavur became a center of learning and culture and the palace, including the Darbar Hall, saw significant enhancement. The Darbar Hall was not just a political center but also a cultural hub. Sir Foji too was known for his patronage of the arts and the hall would often host performances of music, dance and drama. It was a place where artists, poets and scholars gathered, contributing to the rich cultural tapestry of Tanjavur. Sarfoji to reign marked a golden age for Tanjavur in terms of cultural and educational advancements. He established the Saraswati Mahal Library, one of the oldest libraries in Asia, which holds an extensive collection of manuscripts and rare books. The Darbar Hall under his patronage became a symbol of the dynasty's dedication to learning and the arts. One famous anecdote involves Sir Foji II's encounter with the British officer. The officer, impressed by the opulence of the Darbar Hall and the knowledge of the Maratha ruler, remarked on the grandeur of the court. Sir Foji II, known for his wit and humility, responded by emphasizing the importance of wisdom and cultural heritage over material splendor. This interaction highlights the king's recognition of the true essence of his rule, rooted in intellectual and cultural richness. Today, the Darbar Hall remains a significant tourist attraction, drawing visitors who are eager to experience its historical and architectural grandeur. It stands as a testament to the rich cultural heritage of Tanjavu and the legacy of the Maratha rulers who transformed the region into a flourishing center of arts and culture. The 
Darbar Hall of the Tanjur Palace is more than just a relic of the past. It symbolizes the enduring legacy of the Maratha dynasty and their invaluable contributions to Indian art, culture and history. Thanks for joining us on this journey through time. Don't forget to like, subscribe and hit the bell icon for more fascinating stories from history. Until next time.